Hello. I'd like to discuss with you a George Washington biography that uh, really resonated with me and got me excited about learning uh, the things about his life. And that is uh, George Washington, First in War, First in Peace by James Crutchfield. And there's an excerpt in the back here that uh, really made me think and it was thought provoking to me to want to do this YouTube channel and the th what George might do today. It says on page 221, what can be said or written about George Washington that hasn't already been recorded? He was a man of humility, yet strong principle, a warrior who showed no quarter to his enemy. Yet when the conflict was over, he forgave and even pardoned a statesman who in retrospect so understood and interpreted the workings of a democracy that today historians still marvel at. His near perfect insight into problems that faced the young nation. The paragraph goes on to say that Washington was born British, but he became thoroughly American. Recognized by friend and foe alike, alike as a guiding light for the colonies in their fight for independence and later for the United States as it began its difficult journey to world recognition and respect. George Washington was born on February 22nd, 1732. And little did he know when he was young and a surveyor, or even when his father passed away, the things that would happen to him in his life. His mother, Mary Ball, was very loving but also very tough. George was effectually the man of the house when his uh, stepbrother uh, Lawrence passed away. And in his journey after Lawrence passing away and his father Augustus dying, he had to grow up quick. And I'm very excited to uh, talk to you about this and to talk about books like this and other books behind me uh, about how George Washington was always ready to defend, but always, always ready to forgive and forget. And I'm very thankful for that, uh, the example that he set.